So Akio here, I think, was the one who knocked out, knocked Fernandizi to losers in an earlier match. So Fernandizi being on the power rankings, definitely a solid player. Definitely a lot of potential here. So looks like we have Akio on Marth. And turns on Falco, as usual, yes. Yeah. And they picked Yoki's story. It's interesting that Terrans love Yoshi's open. Because Marth is notorious for getting a lot of space in here. Being able to space uh, his force matches off the platform, stuff like that. But Terrence not shaken. Taking the first off very convincingly. Shooting some lasers, good stuff. That's a nice down smash there, just catch him jumping. Terrence Deli with some solid stuff, spacing him out, even though he doesn't have a lot of space on Yoshi's store, you know, he's using those lasers to his advantage. Just getting those hits in, but there we go, able to get the. Oh, wow, really interesting. I think he was going for the forward B spike on the third hit there. Going for the swag, but not quite working out. And Terrence able to get a little more damage, but he. Lasers the wrong way, he's smiling about that one, he knows a little goofy. Alright, hits a solid back air, just send Marth right off the edge of stage there. Man. Such solid play by Terrence here. Oh, able to get a grab? Not too much off of that. Good yeah, by Terrence to get out. Let's see if Aki. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Just notice he has the NJ tag there. He's definitely repping, repping his home team. But uh, he's up against a strong competitor here. Terrence actually hitting with the forward air, the flutter hush. Just to knock him a little too far there. Oh, there we go. Getting some started. That was nice. Not able to connect the combo there. Wow, again with the forward areas by Terrence. I don't know if that's a flood where he's just doing it for the fun of it, but it always looks cool to see those flutter hushes get out. Like a million kicks on those. Okay, there we go. Good edge guard there by Akio. Still in it for sure, as Marathon Yoshi story, he can get a lot of leverage and take some stocks really quickly if he capitalizes, but uh, based on the playing so far, Terrence looks like he has a comfortable lead. Ooh, don't count him out though. A series of chain grabs there, but again, not able to quite finish uh, his combo. <laughs> and Terrence just going for the dumpster, but unfortunately missing there. So Martha 90%. <clears throat> All it really takes is one grab for Martha to come back from this. So I'm not going to say that Akio's out of it, but Terrence definitely trying to keep state control and stay in strong control here. And Martha's just looking to get a grab, get some damage started. Ooh, and the counter. So risky. But uh, he's not killed quite yet for it. Terrence going for the forward air there instead of a back air. Oh, and there's a back air weak hit. Going for, yep, going for Randall right there. Wow, with the short hop there, there from the edge from Terrence. Just take him out clean. Yeah, Terrence won. First game. It's a good show, though. And here we are on Final Destination. Marth uh, is Akio's counter pick. Hoping to get some chain grab started. Ooh, wow, that was really cool. And wow, Akio just turned it around with a really quick stock from Terrence, revving his voice from NJ. What? Oh my god, dude. First of all, why do you keep calling it remote? You need to buy your remote to play. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Score? Do you want? Well, 
Alright. So back to the match here. Skill sake. Uh, still a one stock lead, a solid one stock lead actually from Akio, able to maintain his lead. Uh, both of them are very high percents here. Um, and whoever gets this stock here, I feel like it's going to be a big momentum shift. And there it is, wow. Akio now with the two stock lead, although he's at very, very high percent. I feel like getting that stock there was a bit of a momentum change. And wow, Terrence with the glove, I think. Just a little bit of misclick buttons there, unfortunate, but nothing we can do. But Akio looking really strong in the second game on, F on uh, Final Destination here. Ooh, and the counter working out that time. This is boy gonna. Okay, no four stock, no four stock today. If Terrence got four stock on the stream, I would, I would eat my shirt. Okay, no JV either, but uh. Terrence wants to win this, he's definitely got an uphill battle to climb. <laughs> really good chain grab by Akio, going for the edge guard, follow the dare. And the down tilt just to knock him straight out. Akio saying, you know, New Jersey ain't nothing to mess with. We out here, so repping it strong. Here we go, game three on Battlefield. Both of these guys showing convincing games against each other in game one and two, so it's gonna really go any direction I feel like. Here we go, Akio trying to get started with those grabs. Wow, Akio. I feel like he's getting more into his zone. Like game one he wasn't looking that strong, but game two. Of course it was FD, but he was looking looking really solid. Ooh, <laughs> go for those down airs again. I feel like it's like so much swag there. And with a nice tip to just finish off Terrence's stock there. So Akio sitting at 60%. Uh, again, I feel like it matters a lot whether or not Terrence can take the next stock or if Akio is going to be able to get a stock. But right now it's looking like Terrence is going to try and space him out with those lasers. Solid stuff. See if he can land an aerial to get the kill. Oh, nice up tilt. Just waiting on the top platform, they're patient, trying to bait him onto something. Ooh, wow, the laser cancel. That was really cool. And for it though, a lot of unorthodox stuff here by Terrence. Going for the light shield. And able to close it off with the back air there, I believe. So Terrence only with uh, about a 60% deficit, and as I say that, he's making less, but... They're back and forth right now. It's an intense match. Ooh, wow. Crisp. Really good edge guiding by Akio so far, it looks like. We can get this one. Oh, I missed the down to Let's go attempt though. And there you go. Oh, oh, he tries to get it back when he gets the Phantom on the downer. And then he just gets stage spiked by that forward air. Wow, that was. That was crazy. Like, you hate to see that happen. Oh wow, good power shield though, by Akio. Terrence is gonna try and see if he can close this out. Just a little bit of a percent deficit right now. Oh wow, that was really quick exchanges there. Right at the edge, and Terrence with a good spacing. Should be able to yep, just clean up the stock there. So, you know, definitely still anyone's game. 31%, I think. Uh, Akio definitely surprising a lot of people here by uh, keeping it really close down to game 3 with one of Hawaii's top contenders. So, shout out to Akio. But uh, yeah, looking really close, two stocks each. Some good dash dancing there by Akio to stay out of range. A little bit of a combo there for Terrence. Ooh, and he does the forward beyond the stage, catches Akio off guard. Really solid. And with the tipper, just to finish him off there. 
This is huge right here. Oh my god, is that it? No, he misses the counter. And the double dip there by Terrence. Let's clean it up and bring it back. Akio had a huge opportunity there, but let's see what can happen. Definitely still getting a lot of hits in. 78% lead. Terrence, I think, going for the platform cancel there. Now quite making it the fourth smash is gonna clear it out. Akio. Sending our boy Terrence to losers.